The Access Group provides software solutions in a number of different industries with everything from health and social care through to recruitment and the hospitality which is the division that I work in. Most of our applications are really business critical. A good example would be if the table service and booking solution doesn't scale well and we're having performance issues in the middle of service, we don't know whether a table is available, we don't know if it's, if it's booked, that can lead to problems that will affect our customers' customers and will stop them from, from providing a great service. Yeah, well, when you've got a number of different solutions monitoring different things, you can get a lot of alerts coming in from different places and then when they overlap it can be far too noisy and then you've got to learn different systems and have to tune the alerts in different systems. So being able to consolidate into one platform has allowed us to reduce that noise considerably. My first impression on New Relic was just how much it gave you out of the box. I roll it out with Teams and just within the first hour of having New Relic, if they've never had an APM before, they're just fascinated. It's given us the ability to look across the entire stack in a single place, trace user experience from the browser through the API layer to the database and identify those bottlenecks very, very quickly and then take remediation action if we need to or feed our backlog with technical improvements. The meantime to response and the meantime to detection is just so much better. And you're talking minutes rather than hours and then sometimes days to get a solution. We've been able to isolate modules of the application and analyse the performance of that module depending on how business critical it is. So we can understand where the load is, we can correlate that to performance bottlenecks and then obviously resolve those bottlenecks. With actual genuine business metrics rather than just performance metrics. New Relic's definitely helped us shift left. We're looking at performance in our development phases, we're capturing errors earlier in that development lifecycle, and it's allowing us to go into our testing phase with a lot more quality, and so it's allowed us to get to production a lot quicker and with a lot more confidence. It doesn't always have to be new functionality or bug fixes that you're working on. You can actually pick up on slow processes and improve the software, which in the end improves the customer experience What's great about New Relic is that we're constantly able to add more observability into the platform. So adding synthetics in, then putting service levels around those synthetics, then getting alerting over that, combining that with workloads, and really giving us that real insight into what that looks like. New Relic helped me grow my career primarily as making me a better engineer, getting real-time feedback on the code that I'm writing in the development environment. So it's really helped me refine my coding and also as an engineering manager, it's helped me provide better solutions to production and to our customers, which again helps, helps me move forward as an engineering manager.